Brent Trites had better get moving. He's late getting his maple trees tapped this year, and now they are literally bursting under the pressure. Just keep taking sap in and freezing and thawing, and at some point in time, they'll get too much sap in them, and they'll start busting their bark, blowing their branches off. Brent says the explosions only happen in maple trees that normally get tapped every year. They're used to being relieved of their pressure, so they don't have the outside surface to hold the pressure anymore. So Brent has to relieve the pressure before they burst. If you listen carefully, you can actually hear he's not getting to them all. The old fellows used to talk about it, but this is actually the first year I've ever seen it happen. Brent's right. We talked to an expert at the local university, an expert in arboreal thermal dynamics, and they said that maple producers have been dealing with this destructive phenomenon for decades. The smaller explosions usually happen during the day and they're less destructive. But at night, once temperatures drop below freezing, that's when the real gushers happen. And it's just a boom. And there'd be a side off the tree, a limb off the tree, branches off the tree, the bud tips flying off the tree. It's just astronomical. And the noise can be heard for miles. In fact, the neighbors are starting to complain. There was one lady, she said that her picture fell right off the wall. And I was thinking, oh, my soul, Brent, you better get to those trees and do something about them. You just rush around and try to get all the trees tapped you can to do uh, cut the damage as much as possible. And only hope he doesn't get caught in the crossfire. I think it's April 1st, is it not? It is. It is. Wouldn't that be something now if somebody swallowed a story like that? Hook, line, and sinker. For the Weather Network, I'm Shelley Steeds in Stilesville, New Brunswick. <laughs>